I'm Lynn Bowie, and this is a WJZ 13 at your desk update. Several residents in Baltimore are forced to take shelter after a chemical spill creates a toxic cloud over some neighborhoods. Fire officials say workers were transferring raw material when something went wrong and chlorosulfonic acid escaped into the air, creating that acid cloud. No injuries were reported, and the shelter in place was lifted within two hours. The investigation into the spill is now underway. Tragedy for the Baltimore Orioles. A young prospect on their minor league team was killed in a car crash. The O's held a moment of silence for 21 year old Miguel Gonzalez before last night's game against the Red Sox. He died in an accident in the Dominican Republic over the weekend. Gonzalez was signed in 2014 and has pitched for the O's Dominican Summer League the past three seasons. Worcester County Police helped make several arrests as part of a human trafficking operation last week. A dozen people were arrested in Ocean City between last Thursday and last Saturday. Most faced prostitution or drug possession charges. The suspects range in age from 25 to 60. They're from Maryland, Delaware, and Pennsylvania. Baltimore County Executive Kevin Kamenetz throws his hat into the ring for governor. He, earned, he entered the very crowded Democratic primary for the state's top job on Monday. At his announcement, the county executive launched an attack against Republican Governor Larry Hogan. He has served two terms. Is Baltimore County Executive. WJZ is always on and tune into Eyewitness News at noon, 4, 5, 6, and 11. For constant updates, stay right here at CBSBaltimore.com.